I've drawn lots of little grasses and um, seed heads in the background here and what I'm going to do is draw in some of them with fine line pen to add a sort of illustrative effect to this watercolour. We're going to have a, a mixture of media in the background here so we're going to have some of this fine line black pen and we're also going to use our watercolour as well. So I'm going to start off by showing you how to use your fine line. So I'm choosing this very fine grass here in the foreground and I'm simply going to pick out the design in a sort of pen and ink style. So this represents grasses. So I'm just going to very carefully stroke in individual lines, not solid. So filling in the shape of these little seeds with a series of individual line strokes to give it a tonal quality. As we move down, they perhaps get darker, so you could start to fill in more solid areas here. So the aim of this is to build up this whole background to imagine that the hair is sitting in a field of grasses but we're using the opportunity to use lots of different styles for each of the grasses. So we sort of move along and, and just sort of enjoy this part and you can make up the grasses, you can do them out of your imagination or you can find some reference or pick some pick something from the garden. So here I'm going to show you how to bring the grass across the front of the body of the hair. So you're actually drawing on top of your previous watercolour. That's why it actually helps to draw in pencil line first so you have a plan and you can see where you're going. So this leaf here is going to go across. So because it's going across, I'm making it darker. So I'm going to fill in much more of this in a solid black. You can switch to a, a pen that's not quite so fine. This one's a touch thicker as we're filling in. And then that will show quite well across the front and look as though the hair is actually sitting behind these grasses. So this isn't realistic, this is a illustrative, illustrative composition here and giving you the chance to play around with some different plant forms which hopefully you'll, you'll enjoy doing. So I'll carry on with that, I'll carry on with some black and then I'll show you a sample of the watercolour as well. 